Hey, I'm back, guys. Crypto Keith here with Crypto Living. And we're looking at today's cryptocurrency market capitalizations. Obviously, we have a Bitcoin dominance. That's a little bit more than the rest of all the tokens combined. So 56.4%. Um, we have a 24-hour volume of 7,900,000 million so uh market cap of 243 billion dollars and when we look at our top market cap uh coins here we have bitcoin ethereum bitcoin cash ripple litecoin and then dash neo iota monero i think iota has jumped as well as NEO on this list. We have uh, we have higher market caps in NEO and IOTA. So all the money combined in NEO and IOTA has went up. So these tokens are, are going up. NEO hit around $50, which is very nice. I was holding some waiting for it to get back up to that $50 mark, which is its real, uh, Real price is around fifty dollars. It was just, it was just low for a couple months there. And um, hopefully we now stay around forty dollars or higher with Neo, which I think might happen. Monero is moving towards the hundred and fifty dollar mark. Iota is at about a dollar, which is interesting because I remember buying Iota and EOS. When they were both uh, under 50 cents about a, a month or two ago and now we see that EOS has uh, quadrupled and IOTA has doubled give or take Amisigo watch that one uh, coming up in the next month or two it should go up and we have QTIM around $15 which is nice as well if you own any QTIM. But other than that, we have some uh, new tokens to talk about today. So going into our change, our uh, top change in the past 24 hours, we have a 61% gain with Power Ledger, Bitcoins a 35.8% gain, Raiden Network 25% gain, 10x 20% gain, uh, BitShare, 17% gain, and then Pura, uh, we have a 16% gain. And Pura here is uh, a new, newer token. If you haven't uh, done any research on that, we'll share that with you today, as well as Bitquence. So looking at Bitquence, it's about $2 at a almost 40% gain. So it went from around $1.30 up to around the $2 mark in the past day or so. The volume is getting higher and higher every day, it seems. And this coin could go up more towards the $10 mark. If we look at their social media here, um, they don't have a Twitter. But they do have Reddit. So we also can go check out their website, which I have open right here. I was doing a little bit of research myself. So Bitcoins unlock the future of investment, empower the world. The people powered cryptocurrency platform for everyone. We'll just watch the video. It's a lot easier. Bitcoins is a people-powered universal cryptocurrency service that makes it easy and safe for users to interact with the new economy. In this video, we will show you the many unique advantages that Bitcoins offers in the world of cryptocurrency. Everyone knows about Bitcoin, but there are hundreds of other rapidly growing cryptocurrencies to choose from. Each one requires their own private and public keys and often a dedicated digital vault. How do you know which coins to buy? How do you manage different wallets and keys for each currency? 
and how do you keep your funds safe and secure at all times? Bitquens combines a universal mobile wallet with a secure liquidity layer that works with multiple cryptocurrencies and coins. This means that you can carry and use a variety of crypto funds wherever you go. Here's how it works. Using Bitcoins, users can use Bitcoin, Ethereum, or cryptocurrencies to instantly purchase diversified baskets of coins. For example, you could buy a basket of BitCap coins, such as Ethereum, Bitcoin, and Nano. Or, if you choose, you could pick privacy coin baskets such as Pivx, Monero, and Zcash. Bitcoins even offers baskets of community-curated crowdsell coins, like Augur, MadeSafe, and SeaCoin. With Bitcoins, you can invest across multiple cryptocurrencies instantly, enjoying the convenience of one-click diversification. Your funds are stored in the Bitcoin's cold vault, offline cold storage, keeping your funds incredibly safe and secure and impossible to penetrate. There is also no leverage in Bitcoin's. The cold vault syncs regularly with the Bitcoin's liquidity network, eliminating the exposure to Bitcoin's and Bitcoin's users. Bitcoin's tokens are used as gas for storage and transaction fees on the Bitcoin's network. Automatic gas conversion keeps costs low and creates additional liquidity for the Bitcoin's network. Bitcoin's tokens can be used to transfer value through the network. You can transfer Bitcoin's to any email or phone number in the world free of charge. Eventually, merchants will be able to put a QR code on any bill and get paid with the currency of their choice. Bitcoins will allow digital value of any form to be quickly and safely transferred, making it easy for users to interact with a new economy. Let's invest in the future together, today, with Bitcoins. So, it seems pretty cool. It seems like it will actually have a use in the world. And it offers something unique, which I like. It actually solves a problem. It'll be nice uh, to be able to invest in ICOs this way and invest in baskets of tokens. It's pretty interesting, as well as the merchant um, application. Seems pretty useful. Having a QR code instead of a barcode on any product and then being able to accept your currency of choice. So we have here different wallets and what they um, are capable of supporting. So we have Case Wallet, UberPay, Mist, Exodus, Trezor, Coinbase, Ledger Nanos, and Mycelium. So we see here that they all have fund transfers. Um, but mobile support, only UberPay and Coinbase have. Asset allocation, only Bitcoin, Bitcoin everything but missed. Cold storage, um, everything except UberPay, missed, and Mycelium, as well as Coin Coinbase does not have cold storage. Wow. Managed keys, so you managing your private keys. Case. Coinbase, and that's about it, which seems wrong. So it, it must be they manage your keys for you. Software interface, well, Case doesn't have that, but all the rest do. Altcoins, Case does not have, Exodus does not have, and Trezor does not have, as well as Mycelium does not have. ERC-20 tokens, Case does not support, Exodus does not support, Coinbase does not support, and Mycelium does not support. Token classification, everything, oh, nothing supports except Bitcoin. So you see Bitcoin um, has all of these. You can invest in uh, ICOs, it has cold storage, and uh, things like that that are useful and that uh, consumers look for. Share predictions, win contests, and earn rewards, which is pretty cool. So if uh, you predict the right um, market outcomes, you can win rewards and contests, which I think it's good in the beginning to just practice that and not with your own money. So maybe you can enter these contests in the beginning to see if you uh, know how to predict the markets 
and uh, and then start using your own money once you win some contests and you you know that you're you're on the right track. So the BQX token. All we need to know now is where to get it. So going to markets, we see we can get it on Binance, Hit BTC, Coin Exchange, Ether Delta, and Livecoin. So we'll show you how to uh, set up some of these accounts. We'll do it with you. Binance, Hit BTC, Ether Delta. Um, we just got on Q Coin Exchange, which is pretty cool. Uh, so when you buy Q coins over here on Q Coin Exchange, you actually get uh, part of all the fees. So they share 50% of all fees collected with people that hold Q coin shares. And you can see I have 109. I only had 10, but in about three days of holding 10, I got a bit of all coins that uh, all of the coins that Q coin holds. I got part of the fees. So now I, I hold small percentages of all these tokens. So I put 100 tokens in here now. So I'll get a bit more um, every couple days. And then maybe we'll have to put 1,000 in and go from there. And I bet you if we have 1,000 or 10,000 in, we'll actually see that we'll, we'll be collecting some coins um, over time rather than percentages of coins will actually be collecting coins. So that's something if you're interested in you can do. Um, I'm going to start moving most of my money, not most of my money, but a, a nice chunk of my money over here, my investments, my cryptocurrency investments, and put, put as much as I can into Qcoin shares because Instead of my money sitting on another exchange, I'd rather have it here, um, earning me every token on here, earning me some, some fees. The only thing is, you have to be careful about these exchanges. People can try to hack them. So I'll be looking into making uh, my account more secure and seeing um, if they have things like cold storage. We don't want um, a repeat of what's, what's happened in some exchanges in the past. So just because you're making, just because they're offering massive profits, be careful and also make sure that they're secure. So Binance does the same thing. So that's probably the next uh, next exchange we'll try out, and we'll try the same thing on Binance. And then we have our our money diversified, and we're earning tokens on two exchanges just in case something happens on one. We have uh, we don't don't have all our eggs in one basket. So Bitcoin market cap here is about 138 million. They have a total supply of 222 uh, million and a circulating supply right now of 74 million, which is not bad. That's a nice number right now, um, which helps it reach that dollar 86 and could help it even move towards that $10 mark, like I said. So our next coin is going to be Pura. So here we are with Pura. We have a market cap of around the same. We have more Pura in, in circulation, but um, a total supply of around the same as Bitcoin. So we have a $473,000 volume because it's a very, very new token. And they, they have some... Um, some opportunities right now to earn free pure coins um, like for instance on Qcoin exchange when you here we go so when you put 0.1 bitcoin or 2 ether you get 10 free pura um, when you put 0.5 bitcoin or 10 ether onto uh, Qcoin exchange you get 75 free pura but like you said, again, you got to be careful. The more they're trying to uh, suck people to put their money on the exchange, uh, the more you have to, to, to question it. So the more uh, opportunities on the exchange and the more money they're promising, the more you have to look into how secure it is. Because uh, really, they could be attracting people to put money on here and then 
hacking it themselves, saying it got hacked, leaving with all the money. I'm not saying that's going to happen on Qcoin. I'm just saying you have to open your mind to the possibilities that these things could happen to protect yourself just in case because people do have ill intentions. There are people that want to take all your money. Not everybody in the world is nice and looks at things the same way you do. So that's Pura. Their social media here is Twitter. So we have these tweets here. Pura listed on Qcoin, coinpayments.net. So after seven weeks, they have 17,000 Pura wallet addresses on record. So that's interesting. Moving on to their website now. Actually, let's check out this chart real quick first. So mainly just came on coin market cap right here. Had barely any volume. Then people started to realize what it was and started buying it. So we have nice spikes in volume here. And uh, and it definitely could go above a dollar and beyond. So that's another token that you may want to hold. And we'll look into why now. So on their website, we can see that uh, Pura is digital cash. Uplift your world with digital cash. But it's not just digital cash. And when you watch the video, you'll see what I mean. In an economic climate of spiraling debt, skyrocketing inflation, and an almost total loss of financial privacy, many wonder how to keep their finances safe. Forced to pay money into opaque systems and confused by the results, more and more turn to cryptocurrencies like Bitcoin as a way to reclaim their power and security. What they find, though, is much the same. Power concentrated into the hands of the few and an unfair distribution of wealth in the community and the little guy and his voice getting squeezed out of the game. And if the mainstream perceives Bitcoin as hijacked by unruly gangs of teenagers or used with no plan to replace tax or social security losses with something better, it's no surprise Curious Eyes have been tracking the blockchain and tracing transactions back to people. Some cryptocurrencies responded, adding extra layers to guarantee privacy and decentralized ways to advance technologically and reach more people. But humans are social, and none have managed the social breakthrough needed to replace the old and reach mainstream acceptance. Even the most extreme libertarian will concede that the money for the new high-tech ambulance or the firefighters that came to save the neighbors the other day has to come from somewhere. Pura is a digital cash movement for the common good, and what that means is in your hands. We believe people are fundamentally good and given a voice, a choice, and the tools to thrive and collaborate, life just gets better for everyone. Throw in a cash revolution here, and a new way to make a difference there, and ta-da! You've got a self-sustaining ecosystem that's good for the world. You see, with Pura, special software levels the playing field and empowers the little guy with a fair share of the mining rewards. And because a chunk of every new Pura mind automatically goes to the common good, End users get to decide on how it's spent. Whether that's cleaning up the ocean, fighting deforestation, feeding those in need, or even getting water into disaster zones. Projects are blockchain tracked and transparent, so there's no need to trust the third party based on good faith alone. Traditional centralized systems are opaque and can be inefficient or even corrupt. With Pura, social contributions get tracked. The spending of funds is transparent, and fund recipients are held accountable to the community. And because all this happens through a next generation digital caste system, transactions are confirmed faster than you can shout democratically decided social contributions, while your financial information stays completely private. And we're just getting started. Join the movement and uplift your world with Pura Digital Cash. Pura is liberating it's an international digital currency that empowers you while protecting the planet. 
Pura puts the power back into your hands. Pura protects the planet by being the world's first socially and environmentally conscious cryptocurrency. Pura is transparent. It directly funds fully transparent blockchain traded so sustainable environment and social projects around the globe. So it helps empower everybody. This conscious cash, which I like because I am a conscious person myself. I am very spiritual um, on my off time from cryptocurrencies, that is. I like to meditate and things like that, clean up uh, the garbage around here. And I'm trying to start projects to help do things like that too. So Pura is good in my books. So that's about all for today, guys. We have some losses here, some top losses. Uh, so maybe some coins you want to get into right now because um, people are not, there might be some doubt as to these coins, or at least they're on a downtrend right now, which gives you an opportunity to get in. But you also have to check out the bigger picture and see if they're actually on a down, um, or if they're actually low right now. They could be at a low high or a low low, like this one, B3. But overall, just do your research. But if, if some of these tokens are the ones you want, they're, they're down a bit today, so might be worth getting into, like Populous here. Uh, gas, salt, o open trading, OTN, um, Walton, things like that. Metal seems to be pretty interesting too. Metaverse, Pivx, Adex has made me some money. Um, you know, it's all good. It's all good. Everything. Uh, Everything will be up and up. Everything will be kosher. We have 1,300 cryptocurrencies. Nice even mark number there today. And we have way too many markets, exchanges. And uh, we have a lot of ICOs coming out in November and December. So hit that bell down below. Get on a no notification squad and you'll catch our ICO videos and our other cryptocurrency market cap review videos. See you next time. Peace.